it's Jen. Um, I'm just here with the very quick um, idea that I stole from Susie. Um, she got my brain to thinking today with her um, video on tissue tape. So I, I had had some tissue that I had been thinking about this idea for a while. But then after she did hers, I was like, oh, I hope this works. So I tried it and it absolutely does. So I used tissue paper. But I used tissue paper with a pearlized backing because it's a bit sturdier than your normal tissue paper. It's got it's got a bit more bite to it. So that is helpful. So then all I did was I cut it into a strip, I don't know, probably four inches wide. And then I turned it over to the non-shiny side. I know white on white you probably can't see. But anyway... Um, I'm not at my craft desk. I'm at my office desk. So I just stamped all over this with a background stamp. And then I went over it in stripes with different patterns so that I would have more than one pattern of tissue tape. And I, I, got, um, I got this guy. Whoops. Hold on one second. <laughs> Everything just went everywhere. Yay! <laughs> All right, come on now. So this is what I wound up with. Hold on one second. Sorry. So I wound up with this whole thing. So I just background stamped it into brown stays on. And then I went over it with black stays on with different patterns. And I was really just futzing around. So nothing um, is the way maybe it would be if I were really doing it for a reason. But this actually came out pretty cool. Then I ran it through my big Xyron. So now I have tissue tape with a sticker on the back. So um, that's that. Well then, I wasn't happy with that. So I took it a step further and I used Lindy Stamp Gang stuff on it. Now this up top I used... Um, the Van Dyke sepia. I really like these colors. <laughs> the Van Dyke sepia on the top. So it really gave it that aged effect. And I sprayed it and then I heat set it. And then I, whatever didn't stick, I just dabbed off. Um, and I just heat set it for a couple seconds, not till it was perfectly dry. So you could see it's darker here, lighter there, da da da. Then on this stripe, I used um, some kind of something olive glimmer mist which is one of my favorite colors. And I got it in a, a little kit of three. I'm going to have to find that color in a big bottle because um, I can't quite duplicate that color. And then this is crow's nest copper down here. So it's got that, it all has that sheen to it. And then I just, uh, just to see if it worked, of course you have to let this dry fully because you've got the sticky on the back. So if you don't let it dry, um, it's not going to work. So then you just, I put this in my paper cutter and just cut a strip off to whatever I wanted it to be and pulled it off and it works like a champ. I was shocked. I was shocked at how well it worked. Hold on one second. This is my screen <laughs> of my computer. Um, so I'm just going to tear a piece. Hopefully that I can. Just tear a piece off here just to kind of show you how, how well it works. And then you just peel this from the backing like you would. Catch your edge with your finger, it'll roll up on you. So you have, oops, <laughs> and I just ripped it. So you have this piece of tape that is very thin you know, I mean, it's only as thin as the tissue paper, so, but it's, it's every bit as good as, uh, the stuff you pay $8 for in a roll, and you can do whatever you want with this just as well. So, you know, I hope you could see that. <laughs> I hope I wasn't too close, but I was kind of holding that with my arm and my chest, <laughs> so, <laughs> you know. So anyway, it works very well. This is this is how it uh, how it looks. You could, and then of course you could do 
you can do the different colors on it too. And if you could, I guess you could cut it first and then do the colors, but either way, you gotta let it dry completely. I just hung it on my clothesline in my basement. And just let it dry that way. And it was fine. So that's what you get. All right. I hope that helps somebody. Susie, thank you for the inspiration. And I will talk at you guys later. Hugs and squishes. Bye.